In this video I'd like to cover writing to an ECU. The first step is to connect your wallet tracing interface to both the ECU and to your computer. If you're unsure on how to do this, go to our website and click on the user guides page. There's user guides for the various interfaces we have available. If you open up one of the user guides and scroll down to the ECU flashing mode, you'll see that to put the interface into ECU flashing mode you need to make sure that the red LED is on on the interface. There's also installation instructions for the various harnesses that we have available. So once you have your interface connected to your computer and your ECU and it, the interface is in flashing mode, open up the bullet tracing tune software and either create a new bin file or open an existing bin file. So for this example I'm going to open a Kawasaki ZX-10R bin file. Once you've done that the right ECU button becomes available. So once you've gone through and made various changes to the bin file and you're ready to write to the ECU, click the right ECU button. Because we've made changes to the bin file the software will prompt you to save these changes. So give it some meaningful name, click the save button and the writing routine begins first step is to read the serial number. The next step will be to erase the contents of the ECU and then the writing routine will begin. You can see the status in the bottom of the screen. We're currently erasing the ECU. The ECU has been erased and now the bin file is being written to the ECU. Once writing the ECU has finished, you'll get a dialog message appearing telling you that writing the ECU has completed successfully.